By following a University of Arkansas management plan, soybean growers may significantly increase their yields. As part of a research project sponsored by the Arkansas Soybean Promotion Board, University of Arkansas crop physiologists have been examining how Kip Cullors, a southwest Missouri soybean grower, was able to obtain a national record yield of 160 bushels per acre in his state soybean yield contest. Larry Purcell and graduate assistant Ryan Van Ruckel replicated some of Cullors' management practices on strip trials at the university and select farms in the state in an effort to increase soybean yields here. His management practices aren't economical, and we, we, we recognize that from the start. But what we're hoping we can learn from him is practices that we can implement and take apart and then put on farmers' fields that will be economical. Purcell says Cullors utilized almost constant pivot irrigation, high fertilization with poultry litter, and intensive stress management for weeds, pests, and disease. While his input costs may be prohibitive, the management plan is key. Another critical component is matching the maturity group with an earlier planting date. That seems to be the number one factor that goes into high yield management is, is managing that planting date with a proper maturity group. And that's something that doesn't cost anything. Strip trials this summer on farms at England, Helena, and Newport produced yields of 86, 86, and 93 bushels per acre. While those results may not be achieved over an entire farm, Van Ruckel says growers should be able to increase their yield using these practices. One of the keys to maximizing your soybean yields is maximize the number of pods per plant. That's really the best way to increase your yields. Anything you can do to keep all the pods that you set and additionally to set the most pods. These soybeans here are loaded with pods from the top to the bottom. We've got multiple seeds per, per node, all the way to the top and all the way to the bottom. And this is at 140,000 plants per acre. The Arkansas Soybean Yield Challenge offers a cash prize of $50,000 to the first grower who produces a 100 bushel yield on a five acre tract. The contest has attracted several participants, but so far no winners. Purcell says by applying production practices used in the contest, in addition to the university's recommendations, Growers should be able to see significant increases in their yield.